Hi guys, it's Audrey and I'm getting ready to go this morning and I thought I'd um, look at you <laughs> look at you guys talk to you guys before I go to my doctor's appointment to let you see at least I look a little bit better <laughs> anyway today is my um, bone marrow test so the one that I'm nervous about so anyway I'm waiting for the bus so guess I'll talk to you guys later after my test is over I'm waiting on the bus to come so I can get there talk to you guys later bye I'm at my doctor's appointment and I'm waiting for them to come in. I've had my blood drawn and I want to show you my purse. You're back. Yes. <laughs> we'll be with you in a okay. See, here's my purse and it's going right along with me. I brought it today. Oh, my doctor's appointment. And it matches my armband and it matches my shirt. <laughs> so, I just wanted to say hi. Let y'all know I am doing okay so far. I did have another one on my hand, but she blew the vein there and I got a big bruise, but. I'm okay. See you guys later. Bye. Hi guys. It's Audrey. Well, of course you know it's Audrey. Anyway, um, well, I am home. I am resting. I feel like I had a right to be nervous because that was the most painful test. Oh my God. If you can just imagine someone taking, I don't know if you know what a um, hole digger is, but it's like, it's like two shovels that are put together and you use it to dig a hole in the ground. And it, it, it has like a round, mm, I don't know what you would call it, end on it. Or something that's like shaped in a T and you use it to like um, oh I know uh, corkscrew you know what you take the the cork out of the wine bottle with okay just imagine that and you're laying face down somebody's on your at your tailbone and you're awake with only local anesthesia and that's just to numb the she says she's numbing the bone but I felt everything it was painful so and I asked her before we started it was funny we were talking and she's like okay I'm gonna tell you everything that I do and I was like okay and I said is it gonna hurt and at first, I think she was about to say, no, it's not really going to hurt. You'll probably just feel pressure like they normally do, like at the dentist's office. But she said, yes, it's going to hurt. I said, thank you for being truthful with me. At least I know what to expect. So, oh my God. I just thank God that she did not have to go in a second time because she didn't get enough. So she got enough fluid and bone marrow well she had to get bone marrow and bone so she got enough the first time so I didn't have to do it a second time thank God for that 
but that was very painful and um, I have a picture at the end to show you the slides where they put the bone marrow on the slides and then they have like a little tray there with um, some bone marrow in it and there's like two cups <clears throat> one has fragments of my bone and um, then there's like two tubes of blood and bone marrow that they're going to send off and test and it'll be two weeks before I even know the results of that test but I'm still going to see my doctor on Thursday because we still want to go ahead and start get get to where we need to be on our treatment plan but um, that's how my day went it's been very painful I um, I endured the pain and I told her I said well I promise you not to scream loud <laughs> so <laughs> I had her laughing for a while and so when we finished I said well I promised you that I wouldn't scream loud <laughs> she said oh just quit it just scream it all you're really good I was like okay she said you're really tough because my bone she said my bone was really strong I was like yeah right okay but I felt that pain from my hip all the way down my leg and at one point I did have to tell her to stop and just, you know, let, wait a minute, let me breathe and then start back. But, hmm, anyway, that was that. Um, that's been my day today. And then I rode the bus home. I had to get them to lower the bus down so I could step up there. I wanted to call a cab, but I couldn't step up into the cab because it was in too much pain. <laughs> so, um... And then I forgot to take my pain pills with me because I could have taken one afterwards and probably would have been okay by the time I got home. But the the medication that they used wore off before I got home. So I was in a lot of pain. But the bus driver was very, very nice and he stopped right in front of my apartment and let me off there. And my son was waiting for me at the sidewalk. So he helped me into the apartment and up the stairs because I still had to climb a flight of stairs when I got home. Not a good thing, but I did it. Anyway, um, that's been my day today. Today is Tuesday, and today was the bone marrow test. Tomorrow is Wednesday. I leave at 5, in, 5 a.m. to go and have my pet test. So we're going to see how many little animals we can find. <laughs> Talk to you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Get through, get through, get through. <laughs> See it? Ooh. Man, that is something. Mm -hmm. Yes.